guys, welcome back to the game room uh, with myself and Arkham. So today is day 12 of no school for her and no work for me. So we spend a lot of time together because mom is at work. She's the manager of a bar and although the bars are closed, there's still a lot of paperwork and payroll stuff that needs to be done. So she's working for at least another two weeks. So like I said, it's day 12 for Arkham and I. We've been doing a lot of uh, reading movies um coloring you know just stuff to um fill out the day and have fun together but i want to share with you guys the youtube stuff that i'm also watching all right uh, ah, george dad will steal show everyone george dad will steal uh, ah. so these uh, are five youtubers that i'm watching right now that i really like and these are i guess bigger channels more established channels they all have over a thousand subscribers or more i'm going to show you um a little clip of them and why i watch them why i like it and i'm sharing with you because hopefully you guys will like them and maybe you haven't seen all these channels and you'll want to check them out as well so if this video does yeah. well i'll probably do it either way but i also wanted to uh spotlight some youtubers that are a thousand subscribers or less that you know really put out great videos are entertaining and they are usually very charismatic people but you know for whatever reason they just can't break that 1000 subscriber barrier so today are just, you know, channels that I really like that I think you guys should check out too. And I'll tell you why I watch them. Yeah. And, uh, you know, we're doing something to kill time together. Right, Arkham? Make the yeah. face again. Bah! 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 All right. So check these five out, guys. I hope you like them. Hmm. So the first video that I want to share with you guys, the first channel is the bithead 1000 show so this guy i can't remember how i came across him but he's just so articulated and poignant he comes into his garage and he just talks about his hunting experience he might go to a flea market a yard sale uh he'll go into thrift stores and from the the few years that i've been watching he's constantly buying awesome video games getting great deals and then selling his whole collection and then starting back over so you can see behind him the mother brain painting he actually did that he did the keith courage uh, turbo graphic 16 painting in the background he's very talented he has got crazy things that he builds like look this baseball bat and uh, a bowling ball it's just really interesting stuff it's video game related but he's also a very uh handy guy he could create a lot of stuff he'd be a great guy to have during a zombie apocalypse so check out bithead 1000 sure. the next video i want to share with you guys is Thru's adams t-h-e-w he comes from the uk and he does a lot of reviews on transformers i found him last summer because i was looking for how to put together volcanicus yeah after i bought all the dinobots and i stumbled upon his channel and i've been watching ever since he just he does great reviews he talks really fast he's very again another articulate guy and i like the way he meshes words together he'll say two keywords and then put them together i don't know it's just his thing that he does but it works every episode so this is t-h-e-w through adams check him out if you're into transformers now, I know people are going to say, hey, these guys are pretty big, they're well-known, and if you've ever watched Retro Liberty, you remember Aaron and Ricky, but they were gone for a while, and now they're back as Pixel Game Squad, and their subscriber numbers have never gotten back to what they used to be, which is a shame, because they put out quality videos, they do a lot of the flea market hunting, uh, you can even watch them on Prime Video now, but uh, I just really enjoy watching these guys, they're genuine, they're real, and it's always funny. You know what I mean? Like, when I think of game hunting shows now, it's like okay. Game Chasers and, you know, Retro Liberty, Pixel Game Squad. So, if you're into that and you okay. haven't, hang on, babe, if you haven't heard of these guys, check them out. This next channel is called Transformers and Video Games. Very to the point, kind of like the name of my second YouTube channel where it's video games, toys, and more. But, I was just, you know, going through YouTube looking for uh, information on the... War for Cybertron Siege Astro Train. He was one of the first videos that popped up. I clicked on him and I binge watched about eight videos. Um, you know, he's about 3,000 subscribers. His channel is very much in the same vein as mine, as it's just, you know, talking to you guys, the audience, showing you what I've picked up. 
um, whether it was too expensive or not, buyer's remorse, uh, video games, and Transformers. Very to the point, and like I said, I just found them today, but I've already watched 10 episodes, and I really like it, so Transformers and video games. Check them out. And the last channel I want to share with you guys today is called Athlean X. This is a fitness channel. As most of you guys know, I am a phys ed teacher. I like to stay in good shape, and I always like to find new workouts for myself, my students, and fun stuff for Arkham to do. We made a fun little obstacle course a couple of days ago. So for this one now, uh, Jeff, the, um, the guy that runs the channel, he's showing you all different exercise hacks, the workouts, how it would look in the gym, and how you can do it at home, which is very, very beneficial for us being stuck in the house right now. So I really like watching this channel. There's a couple of different fitness channels that I like, but I wanted to share yeah, Athlean yeah, X with yeah. you guys first. If you haven't heard about it and you're into fitness or you want to get into fitness, this is a great channel to check out. So again, guys, that's just five channels that I'm watching right now. Obviously, it's not all the channels I'm watching. And like I said, I do want to spotlight some of the smaller, more talented shows that could use a little extra endorsement or help, especially at these times when we can be watching more YouTube videos. We can help people with views and subscriber counts. So just scrolling through, guys. Um, where am I at? So March 9th, March 13th, March 17th, March 19th. March 21st, March 23rd, and then today is the 24th, so this will be another video. So we got like, what, five, six videos out in the last week. So, you know, we're uh, we're turning and burning here, and I hope you're enjoying all the uh, upswing of new material. The next video that I want to try and get out, I'm working on right now, is uh, some Earthrise G.I. Joes that I picked up before uh, the whole pandemic started. And I also want to do uh, another Obscure Toy Lines. So I have about four that I'm working on right now, and if you could think of any off the top of your head, let me know, and I'll try and add them uh, as soon as possible. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in uh, probably two or three days. Take care. You want to say bye? Bleh. Yeah. <laughs> you want to say anything on TV? Yeah. Do you want to sing? Yeah. Sing. Sing it, sing it, how I wonder what you are Up above the wheel so high Yeah, I cut a man in the car Tingle, go yeah, look How I wonder what you are Hey! Now I sing wheels on the bus Oh, you wanna sing wheels? Well, hang on, let's do another video and then you can see wheels on the bus Okay? Yeah, you like that? Mm-hmm.